come back to the 2021-2021 school year. It is the first day of school. It is going to be the best day ever. If you don't know me, my name is Mr. Lamp. I am the principal. I'm going to be leading our announcements, but hopefully I can get some other people to join me this year. We are excited that school is open. Everyone's back. And we're going to make this short and sweet, but I uh, want to give you a little sneak preview of what maybe the year is going to look like through announcements. So today is Thursday, July 29th, 2021. We thank you for being here and on time. One of the things that we talk about a lot at the school is SOAR behavior. SOAR is an acronym and it stands for four things. It almost looks like an acrostic poem, wouldn't you say, Mrs. Merrick, our poetry lead here? You'll learn more about that probably later in the year. But it stands for safe, organized, accountable, and respectful behavior. We think we take those four words and we put them into everything here and we really emphasize people doing that right thing. Today I wanted to focus on the last letter in SOAR, and that is the R, and it stands for respect. I want you to pay attention to this building today. Our teachers and our staff spent so much time making this place look beautiful because they want you to know that we want you coming to a place that is extra special. We want you to make sure we keep it looking extra special. And I want you to think about a time where you had something that was really special to you, whether it was a new toy, whether you just cleaned your room and you looked at it and you said, man, this feels great. I want you to remember that feeling. That's how we, all of our staff at Millennial feel about our building right now. And we want to feel that way each and every day at the end of the day, because we know you deserve the best. So take a look around. There's some amazing artwork on the hallways. We're going to keep those hands on our sides when we're in the hallways so that this place does continue looking beautiful. So the one way that we're going to really respect, to show respect today, is by keeping our hands off the walls, looking at them, and just admiring all the hard work that was done. Next up, we got to tell you what's on the lunch menu. I don't have pictures for you today. I will tell you, you have three, that's right, three choices for lunch. There's going to be two hot choices and one cold choice. What that means is two of the meals will be warmer. They've been heated up and one will be cold. So the two heated up lunches today are chicken nuggets and grilled cheese sandwich. Or our third cold choice is a turkey and cheese wrap. It's like a turkey and cheese sandwich, but it's in a tortilla shell. That's it. Two hot lunches, one cold lunch. You have to choose one. Now you can't choose one Take a bite and say, I don't like this. I want to go try the other one. You have to choose one and stick with it. So make sure you make a wise choice. Choose one that you know you are going to like. And the other thing is, and I know those of you who were here last year, it is free. That's right. It's free. Now, some of you bring your own lunch from home, and that is awesome. We appreciate that. And if that's what you like to do, you keep doing that. But if you are not wanting to do that and you want to eat our school lunch, it's free. That's right. F-R-E-E, -E, free all year long. And so you are welcome to take advantage of that. Tomorrow, I don't have our breakfast menu yet, but every morning, again, you're going to have an opportunity to pick up a breakfast for free. That's right. F-R-E-E, -E, free. And I will try to give you a sneak preview of what's coming the next day. And your teachers will let you know when they come pick you up outside. So one of the things that we want to do on our announcements is to inform you of things going on inform you of what's on the lunch menu, special events taking place. In announcements, we want to make sure you get the most important information. We also want to have fun. Fun is more fun to watch, right? We want to, it, it makes it so we look forward to something. So we're going to try to be silly, have some fun with it. We want to involve kids. I want kids involved in this. You don't want to just see me on here by myself each and every day. I want to get kids involved. Not exactly sure how we're going to do that yet, but keep a lookout for that because we want to see kids taking the place of me. Also, we just want to celebrate awesomeness at Millennial, and we're going to do that by acknowledging the amazing SOAR behavior we see, and we are looking forward to doing that. That's it, short and sweet today. That is our announcements. What I would like to do is every day we're going to end with our Pledge of Allegiance and Moment of Silence. I got my good friend, Mr. B. He's our assistant principal. He's going to lead us through the Pledge of Allegiance, and then I've got another friend by the name of Flash and some uh, some little falcons here who are going to lead us through the Millennial Pledge, and then well, Mr. B is going to do the pledge in a moment of silence, and then Flash is going to lead us through the Millennia Pledge. Have a great day. Look forward to seeing you guys around campus. Be amazing and show that respect. Good morning, Falcons. It's Mr. B with your Pledge of Allegiance. Go ahead and please stand up. Take your right hand, place it over your heart. Ready? Begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag 
of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Okay, please remain standing for a moment of silence. Great job. Now we're gonna turn it over to Flash for our millennial pledge. Hi, my name's Grayson. Hi, my name's Keegan. And this is Flash. Let's get started on the millennial pledge. I pledge to be a millennial falcon, watching the store. Safe, organized, accountable, and respectful. Are my name, 